Hey everyone, it's Jordan from Fish Keeping Made Easy and today I'm back with another UK wildlife video. In today's video we're going to talk yet again about the legend that is the Ali Pali Wasp. Now, the Ali Pali Wasp made a couple of appearances in 2022 at the World's Darts Championship and with these majestic appearances we have historically witnessed some good luck to those who embraced the wasp. But this time around it wasn't the darts but the snooker. The Wasp, however, is no stranger to appearing at the Masters. The Wasp actually stung referee Ben Williams in 2020 when he tried to grab the Wasp in an attempt to stop it from harassing the players and disturbing the game. The Wasp made its return on Tuesday night in a game between Mark Williams and David Gilbert, with both of them being the target for the Wasp and also the cameraman. Williams tried to kick the Wasp after it landed on a rather delicate area. Gilbert claimed he wasn't scared of the Wasp, but from his reaction, I think he might have been. So why are we seeing so many of these incidents at the Ali Pali? Now wasps don't die in the winter due to the cold, it's likely more due to a lack of food. The queen tends to hibernate and starts preparations for next year's colony. This can be indoors and people regularly find them in their attics, basements and sheds. The Ali Pali is an old building and the wasps likely find easy access to the building. All the commotion and heat generated from the events can give the illusion that the weather is getting warmer and the wasps mistakenly think it's summertime. There could also be an argument that venues such as the Ali Pali could provide a decent amount of food for the wasp to eat and this stopping the actual colony from dying off. So what's your thoughts? Should the Ali Pali get some better pest control or is it all just good entertainment and publicity for the events? So as always, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like it, subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next one.